Hi, I'm Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. And we are back to Prime Suspects Mystery Case Files number two, and we are finishing it tonight. And she is Aunt Punk. And this game is really small on my monitor, so if I misclick or have a hard time finding things, that is why. All right, let's get this going. We are on number 16, I think of 21 we decided. Something like that. And we shall get started. Level 16, Foley Zipper, AKA the Hollywood Scoop. Occupation, ex paparazzi and gossip columnist. Prior arrest, repeated counts of breaking and entering. Suspect has an affinity for gathering tabloid gossip by spying on movie stars while they bathe. Ew! In accordance to his plea bargain, Mr. Zipper is forbidden to work for, subscribe to, or leave through a printed publication for the duration of his existence on this or any other planet. Good. Sneak into suspect's office and look for clues to his whereabouts at the time of the jewel theft. Now, I'm actually going to assume we have one, two, three, four, five, and then like the major bad guy. I'm guessing the last one is going to be the one that's the prime suspect. Oh wait, no, we have two more people. So one of these and then the last one. And then I guess we're gonna figure it out. And we only have 27 minutes to finish this. So here we go. Do we have any new ones? City Park, did we do? Oh no, we did the City Park. I think we've done all of these. All right, let's start at the hospital then. Okay, so these games are so weird. All right, we need a compass, an eating utensil, that's kind of vague, peanut, that's down by the mousey, and a gear, which I'm positive I just saw, a protractor, which I also just saw, dang it, a backwards murder, that's up here, and a space capsule, which is that it? No, that's a flying saucer. I guess that doesn't count. Okay, so an eating utensil, a gear, and a protractor. And, oh, there's the gear. And the protractor. I did see the protractor. Okay, an eating utensil, twins, which is right here. That's also from The Shining, by the looks of it. Eating utensil, space capsule. Hopefully not the same item. And this isn't it, because that's a flying saucer. Is that it? Yes, okay. Very old school one. Now we need an eating utensil, like a fork or a knife or a spoon, I guess. Oh wait, no, we can go to the next place. When we get down to one in a, a section, we go on to the next place because we don't actually need to find all the things. And I already forgot about that. We need to look for batteries. Okay, let's see. Red shoes, a boat, boat. a necktie. A hot dog. There's a corn dog. Does that count? Nope. Okay. Is that a hot dog? That doesn't look like a hot dog. Looks like it had whipped cream on it. All right. A treble clef. A totem, which is a totem pole, we figured out. And a pumpkin. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin. There's a turkey. Turkeys and pumpkins go together. Kind of. Sort of. All right. Neckties. Wait, did I see stork? I totally miss Stork. And there it is. Totem is under the pink doll. This pink doll? Ah, there it is. Okay. Well, let me click on it, game. Necktie, treble clef, and pumpkin. Necktie. There's a spider. Treble. That dolly needs a haircut. My grandmother collected dolls. And when we were little, we, she would have doll spa days where the dolls all got undressed and we washed their clothes and the dolls got haircuts, or not haircuts, um, hairstyles. And it was fun. And she had little tiny drying racks and a little tiny iron. And I am not looking for things. No, she did not. And she had a whole room full of dolls and they were very creepy. I mean, some of them weren't creepy, but some of them, there's a sandwich. I'm hungry. I should have eaten before I did this. I am not paying any attention. There's the treble cleft. No, the dolls were not that terrifying. I thought they were cute. 
There were only a couple that were terrifying. And they were the ones where, like, this one over here. I don't know if you can see that. That kind of one. Those were creepy. I liked the other ones. All right, let's see. Carousel. A satchel. That's it? Yep. Candy cane. A raccoon tail? Yeah, look at that. A chimp. Into him. A whisk broom. Pumpkin middle left. Yes, it is. Speaking of chimps and those monkey NFT things, a YouTuber I follow that I really like is like, huh, maybe I should make NFTs. And I'm like, no! And everyone else is doing the same thing. No, don't do it. But it could be cool. No. <laughs> so I don't know if he's going to do it or not, but we'll see. Ugh, sigh. I figure the only reason some people are doing it, specifically like people who would never have anything to do with that kind of stuff normally, is just because they have no idea how bad it is. Why can't I find the rubber chicken? All right, we're going to the next place. City Park. Let's see. Roller skates. Flying bird. That's a hummingbird. That's a flying bird. That is a hummingbird. Okay, damn it. That's a bat. Where's there another flying bird? This level annoys me because this was the level where we were looking for a book. See all the books? That wasn't it. That was the book. Matter of fact, I think this is the flying bird. And I'm right. It doesn't even look like a freaking bird. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> As I was saying, it's a snake. Wait, I thought I saw a spider. No, that was in the last one. There's a spider. And boots. And a pineapple. There's a pineapple. There's an elephant and a giraffe and a lion. I think the zoo in the park uh, got damaged. And all the animals are escaping. Escaping? Escaping. Is that that? Yes, it is. You see the fish? Not off the top of my head. Do I see a battery? Nope. Capital City Station. All right, let's see. Three hooks. Oh, they have us do this one every time, and every time I forget where they are. There's two of them. Come on, let me click on it. That's a hook. All right, let's see. A lantern. And a soccer ball. I'm glad we're almost done with this game. It's fun and all, but it's getting kind of repetitive because we keep doing the same levels over and over and over again now. I mean, they have us finding different things most of the time, but still. Time to move on to something else. Uh, da -da -da. Big turtle. Wait, turtle. No, I need three sparrows, though. There's one. There's a fish. I needed a fish in the last level. And a bunny. There's another sparrow. Okay, what else am I looking for? Sparrow leaves, which I just saw. There they are. Okay, and a palm tree. Huh. I think that's a sticker. Yep, there it is. One hook, protractor, two nuts, and a sparrow. Another... Wait, is that the same fish? No, I think that's the second fish. I need to focus. <laughs> One hook, protractor, two nuts, and a sparrow. Is that a sparrow? That looks like a sparrow. Nut on the blue luggage. Oh, I was looking for the other kind of nut, like a... And that one's right here. Yep. I was looking exclusively for that kind, not the peanut. I actually saw the peanut multiple times. Okay, one hook, protractor. That's a compass, not a protractor. And I need a sparrow. Oh, there he is. Way up top. Okay, protractor and a hook. I found the hook like eight times in this game, and I still don't remember where it is. That's very sad. There's a protractor. All right. Next. Piazza Gallery. Oh, that's right. I forgot this one. This is like one of the last ones we found. And I found the battery. Okay, soup bowl. This one is not, like, decorated quite as much. Yeah, <laughs> we was robbed. Um, 
like this there's not as much stuff in this one as there is in the other levels i don't know if they got to this one and they're like oh, i don't feel like doing so much and they just kind of skimped it or if it's like this on purpose i'm not sure but it definitely has much less things. All right, let's see, a maple leaf. I saw the maple leaf. There we go. And a teacup. It's a mushroom. What am I looking for? A star in a teacup. Do, 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 do. Is that the teacup? Yep. Oh, and there's a star. Like this has a third of the amount of stuff in the background as the other ones. All right, let's do this one. All right, two bats, ducks, heart, Three skulls, two shells, a gavel, an axe, and a baseball. Well, there's a skull. There's a bat. I don't need a bat. Yes, I do. Yeah, it's much less easy to do, that's for sure. Okay, so a bat and some ducks. And a butterfly. And a dog. A screwdriver and an arrowhead. Oh, that's my stress. There's an apple. There's a shell. And another shell. Lobster. What else am I looking for? Bat, ducks, hearts, skulls, and... Oh wait, I saw the gavel, didn't I? Nope, I'm crazy. Unless it is there and I still didn't see it. I saw the baseball, too. These levels make my brain hurt. Here's a skull. Cheap Necronomicon. I think I said that last time. Heart. Here's some ducks. A bat. Oh wait, that's a baseball bat, and I did see a baseball bat. There it is. A skull, a gavel, an axe, and a baseball. A skull. What a weird skull. A gavel, an axe, and a baseball. There's baseball. There's a rolling pin. A gavel and an axe. All right, let's start down here and go up. Gavel. I remember finding the gavel in this level before. I don't remember finding an axe in this level. There's this. Oh, there's the axe. That's a pickaxe. And we might as well find the gavel because I know it's here. At least if we find it in this go through. If not, we're going to go on to another level. I swear it's up near the top here. The games are very tricksy. Nope, that's thread. Maybe that's what I saw. All right, let's go to a different one. Okay, let's do the hospital. Eating utensils, so like a fork, a knife, or a spoon. No creepy noises, that's uncalled for. Spoon, top. Oh yeah, look at that. Good job. How many more do we need? We need two more. What's over here? Oh, that's this one. Nope. We don't want to do that one. A carousel, a rubber chicken. You'd think that would be easy to find. Where's this rubber chicken? Chick, chick, chicken? There it is. I found him. He was looking at the ducky. And one more. Let's do the city park. A fish. Is that him? Yep. Okay. That was very well blended. Good job. Okay, we've got a photo. Oh no! It's one of the dudes! Because it's there's a big question mark. Did that go in the right place? No. Okay, there we go. A prime suspect! I don't- Oh, this was the guy who was got in trouble for looking in people's windows. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Every time I see cartoon food, it's like, yes, give it to me. I know- Oops, sorry. I know I need to eat. But it's only six o'clock and I usually eat at six o'clock, but we're having gamers over later and it was going to be loud. So I figured I would do this now, but I did not consider the fact that I was already hungry because I wasn't paying attention to if I was hungry. Because I'm bad at human things. Like eating when you're supposed to eat. I was, so I can see this and then I can see the little picture. But then off screen in the window of my streaming software, I can see about this much of this picture. And I keep looking at the bigger but more blurry version, wondering why I can't see anything. And it's because I'm not actually looking at the correct picture. There, there.
This person needs to clean their office. I need to clean my office. Admirable analyzing, Master Detective. Looks like Mr. Zipper was out the night the Piazza Gallery was burglarized. By all means, record... Oh, uh, sorry. Click below to begin analyzing another suspect. Alright, so we have one more left. And it seems unreasonable to me that we would keep going after we find the last one. So I'm guessing this is the one. That is the last prime suspect. Okay. Susan Williams, Chocolate Sandy, Black Market Cookie Pusher. That seems like a thing that Ot Punk would get into. Suspect repeatedly apprehended for selling bootleg knockoffs of Brownie Girl cookies. <laughs> Miss Williams is currently at large following a botched cookie bust where she injured two federal marshals. Suspects should be approached with extreme caution. <laughs> Go have a look around the city and see if you can figure out where Chocolate Sandy was when the diamond was taken from the gallery. Was she a prime suspect? I'm guessing no. And is this one we've been to before? No, this is new. Okay. Ooh, a jelly roll. Do I need a jelly roll? No, I want a jelly roll. Ooh, there's a cupcake. Let's see, a seal. Is it what kind of seal? What is that? Is that a hippopotamus behind the counter? Like a life-sized hippopotamus? Bizarre. Hot lips. Okay. <laughs> poison mushroom. Do not eat the poison mushroom. Poison mushrooms are not a good idea of a food to have in a bakery. Two gloves. There's a baseball glove. Okay. That's one of them. Oh, and there's the other one. Yes, that is a hippo behind the counter. Apparently the hippo works here. Hot lips on the roses. Aha, you're right. A camel, I already saw him. There he is. Oh, there's a poisonous mushroom. An egg and a paw print. I am not surprised there are paw prints in here. There are lots of animals in here. A seal, an egg, and a paw print. Okay, paw print, middle, bottom, bread. Oh yeah, I saw that. Ooh, that looks good too, whatever that is. Is that the monkey? I don't need a monkey. Oh, there's an egg. Oh, there's an egg. Oh, so that time you're gonna do it that way. Sure, game. Wait, where's this? Oh, there's the seal. Okay, what's next? Let's do the hospital again. A bloody hand. Is that that? That doesn't look very bloody. A hockey mask. A porthole. A yin yang. There's the spinal column. Oh, there's the yin yang. A microscope, which is right here. A nut and a noose. There's the noose. Nooses should not be. Oh, there's the nut. In. That's not. That is a nut. This game is very picky. There's the other nut. Fine. Pier 11. Oh, this is the terrible level. This level is hard to do sea stuff in, especially with the thing so small, because it's very well lit, lit here, but over here it's like almost impossible to see anything. All right, let's see. Mug, fire extinguisher, bucket, which I thought I saw. That's a milk can. A cannon, which is right there. Scorpion, which I thought I just saw. A lime. Oh, there's a battery. Ah, <laughs> I saw the same time. We need to stop doing that. I don't know why we do that. Our brains like find the same thing at the same time. Army men. There's, oh, that's a go Oh, I thought that was a goblin. It didn't look like, wait, where's the grapes? Grapes on the ship roof. Yep. And there's a the lime. So we need a bucket and a scorpion. Oh, there's a scorpion. I did see a scorpion. Is that the bucket? No, it's a barrel. Alright, moving on. Mix gas. Swordfish. A level. A snorkel. A brush. A stapler. And a starfish. My mind is like very fuzzy this evening. Probably because I'm hungry. And a computer disc, which isn't a disc, it's a CD. Meh, 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 meh. 
I don't know if you can hear my children running around and screaming at the top of their lungs in the background, but if you can, I'm sorry. I can't stop them from doing that this time of night. Because all of their medication has worn off. My older children asked me the other day if we could give my, a kid three his medication twice, once in the morning and once at night, so he wouldn't be so loud at night. And I said, no, because then he won't go to sleep. And they said, well, that's fine. I'm like, you don't want him to never want to go to sleep. <laughs> All right, where's this swordfish? That one should be easy to find, especially since I think I found it before. Nope, they don't see it. All right, next. Rialto Theater, a paperclip, there, a pair of dice. If I'm doing this rather fast, it's because I've done some of these levels like eight times. And if I'm being really slow, it's because I've done some of these levels eight times and I can't remember where anything is. So it's like an advantage and a disadvantage to have short-term, weird short-term and long-term memory. A gargoyle, I might know is here. That's sort of like a gargoyle. Gargoyle up left. Oh, I was close. A paddle is over here. A butterfly. And a butterfly. And a gold medal. And a lighthouse. You're supposed to start at the bottom of the list, so we aren't looking for the same thing at the same time. <laughs> There's the pearls. Actually, I think one of the noises I hear out there is my brother who has come to play Arkham Horror with the big boys, which means this is true. Not on purpose, though. The big boys get to play Arkham Horror tonight, which means they're going to be loud in the dining room all night because that game takes forever. The curator's office. Oh, great. I think we have done this week before, but I don't like these. Okay. Sailboat, a red two, a purple bow, a skull, Two pairs of glasses, I saw one. An emerald ring, a lightning bolt, and two hearts. Okay, a sailboat, a red two, and a purple bow. That is not. Hold on, thank you. What am I looking for? Whatever that is. There's an eyeball and a fortune cookie. I need a sailboat, a red two, a purple bow, and a skull. Jersey, I think. Okay, that might just be kid two, not my brother. My, my brother and kid too have the exact same voice suddenly and it's very disconcerting. I don't necessarily mind my kids getting older. It's just very weird when they suddenly change something major about them. Like kid one is getting stupid tall and like none of his clothes fit anymore. That I don't like because that means I have to buy him more clothes. And shopping for kids' clothes is really irritating. And expensive! Like, you'd think kids are smaller than adults. Their clothes should cost significantly less because there's less, like, clothes involved. But no. I need a red too. And what else? A skull and a pair of glasses. And now I hear my husband out there. My family is very loud. And I think I hear Vinny out there, who is one of our friends, who is also very loud. Why am I not finding anything? Oh wait, there's a lightning bolt. Wow, that was hard to see. If this was the real size it was supposed to be, I would be able to see stuff better. Like this stuff is so tiny. Like on my screen, the circle is like maybe twice the size of a quarter, maybe, if I'm being generous. Probably more like one and a half times the size of a quarter. Ah, there's the red two. All right, I just need a skull or a pair of glasses and I can stop. Or I could stop now. Let's stop now and go to the carousel. Okay, licorice, a carrot. Oh, I saw the carrot here, there it is. Uh, cotton candy. Oh man, I miss cotton candy. Since like everything's been canceled for two years, we haven't gone to any of the fairs or anything. And cotton candy is like one of my favoriteest fair things ever. And I miss it. I want cotton candy so bad. I know. <sighs> Sigh. 
it looked like like last year it looked like things were just starting to get better right in time for fair season sorry i skipped ahead i apologize it looked like things were getting better just in time for fair season and sorry and then everything got worse again and we couldn't go what is that i don't know what that is not licorice i wonder if we're looking for black licorice or red licorice Red licorice isn't even licorice. It's just candy that's shaped like licorice and is a weird waxy cherry flavor. I'm not entirely. Sax middle, upper middle. Oh, right there. I think I'm not paying attention now. Compass and a pine cone. I think I saw the pine cone last time I was here. Compass, of course, which kind of compass? Is it a drawing compass or a finding your way across the wilderness compass? The second kind, except that looks like a ship compass rather than like wilderness, wilderness. Ooh, there's a pine cone. All right, I want to use the thing. What is this licorice we're looking for? Oh, it was red licorice. Okay, like a Twizzler or a red vine. Twizzlers don't taste good, but they're fun to um, hit people with while you're waiting for a movie to start. There's the swordfish. Are they? I don't think I've ever had a red vine. What's the difference? I know like the lines are different. Like one is swirly and one isn't swirly or something. And we're gonna use the hint here too. Cause I don't, oh wow. I never would've found that. Aren't it, oh gross. All right, so now we have find it puzzle or uh, memory. Good, I forgot the word memory. That's, that's a good thing. And this memory game is annoying because it has things that look similar. Where is the stupid peanuts? There it is. See, look, this one and this one, those are both peanuts. But you know what? Neither of them was the peanut I was looking for. That's a good thing. My dyslexia is getting me. Oh, where's the stupid peanuts again? Nope, it's up here. Nope, that's not the right one. That's the right one. And this one is down here. Ha! Even. That's annoying. I don't mind doing these when, like, it's very obvious what things are, but this is just irritating. Hey! Like, I get so close mentally, and then my brain's like, nope, it's not a thing. There you are. Your trick to remembering the thing didn't work because ugh, they were too similar. Now the kids and my adult friends and family are arguing because you know what's awesome? Trying to argue with kids who are off their ADHD medication. And yet every time that's what they do. You'd think eventually they would figure out it's not going to work. Yes, also, correct. Nice work. Looks like our little cookie crook was hawking her black market snacks when the giant blue gem was taken from the Piazza Gallery. Okay. You'll have to look elsewhere for a prime suspect. That's fine. Click below to begin analyzing another suspect. Barry Swanson, AKA Spry Guy. Occupation Unemployed Superhero. <laughs> Check fraud and neglect homicide. Oh, that's not good. Suspect, I'm sorry, negligent homicide. Suspect possesses, possessed superhuman speed until his hip went out while jogging on the beach with Captain Zip. His super abilities are now regulated to freezing water in the ice box and predicting the milk is bad. Suspect lives with his grandmother. <laughs> Hunt for a battery to power your scano, scano ray device, then take a peek into suspect's tenement. Find enough clues to figure out where he was when the crime took place. In 35 minutes. It's this, right? Yep, okay. We need a battery for that. Oh, and we need a battery for this one too. Ah. Right. Rocco's news. Dinosaur, dinosaur. Clown. Clown, whale, a straw hat, 
telescope back of the bike. Yes, it is. Two garden trowels. That's a sand thing. I said that last time. And that is a garden trowel. An artichoke. I'm hungry. And a saddle. That is not a saddle, but this is. Yes. A whale and a straw hat. This looks like part of a painting I've seen before. I wonder if it is. There's a skull. There's a straw hat. Can we see the whale anywhere? Nope. Okay. Next. Wait, was there a battery there? I didn't look. Nope. Okay. All right. Madame Ball Palm Reader. Okay. A shepherd's staff. It's a crook. Four hex signs. Oh, we have the hex signs again. Let's see, where are they? Maybe there's one. Hex signs sound like terrible in a cult, but they look really pretty and not what you would expect them to expect to be called hex signs. Half an orange. A record. Okay. Yes. Is it a cult any magic, or is there a difference these days? I thought a cult just meant magic. Then there was dark occults. Yeah, I don't know either. I would say anything that's going in, on in this room is probably just, like, trying to be a cult in some way and not actually succeeding. This looks very proppy, if that makes any sense. What am I looking for? A bell? Oh, wait, I just saw the lizard. I literally was looking at it. Dagnabbit, where'd it go? There it is. Stupid lizard. Okay, a bell, a domino, and two hearts. Okay, I need a domino and a bell. And there's a spade, and that's creepy. And there's a feather, and grapes, and an apple, and a frog, and a lion. Oh, there's a heart. Let's see, and a moon. Oh, there's the other moon. Wait, I don't need a moon. There's two moons though. <laughs> Look, I found them. <laughs> what am I looking for? A bell. Heart, upper right. Uh, oh, there it is. I think that was the same heart I found down here. All right, a bell or a domino. Or a bell and a domino. I don't think this domino is going to be domino colored. Oh, that was the last game we were playing was Grim Tales the Bride. And it was interesting because it had this kind of style of hiding things, but unlike this game where they just change the color of things so it kind of blends in better, they didn't do that. And I thought that was very interesting and much easier to find things. I guess people decided that wasn't realistic or something. It's definitely a thing I've noticed as the games got newer and newer. Is that a bell? No. I can't find the bell. There's a spoon. Oh, there's the bell. Wow, that was right in front of me. That birdie shouldn't have that marble. That is not good eats. Capital City Station. A pigeon. And I don't know where the pigeon is. I forget. That's annoying. I used to know where he was. Okay, I don't care now. A pigeon, a tuning fork, two compasses, a cucumber, a gun, two swords, a sprig of wheat, which is right there. And a caterpillar, which is right here. Okay. Where's the stupid pigeon? There he is. And a tuning fork and two compasses. Which is probably going to be two different types of compass. There's one compass. And a tuning fork. And another compass. And a cucumber. There's a cucumber. Uh, there's a domino. Don't need that here, though. What's my looking for? Tuning fork, compass, a gun, and two swords. Oh wait, I saw the gun. There's a gun. Two swords. There's one. And there's two. Oh, there's the other compass. It was both the same compass. Oh, there's a tuning fork too. Yay! Okay. And community club. Oh, freaking bad. There's three of those in this level? That is really irritating. <sighs> yeah, mm-hmm. Three, count them three. I know, right? All right, let's see here. Bird's nest, swordfish. Woman's eye. Crescent moon, which is not in the sky. Uh, let's see, drumsticks. 
bent nail, a tree, and a flute. Okay, so we need a bird's nest, a crescent moon, and drumsticks. I remember finding the bird's nest. Drumsticks are on the accordion. Yes, they are. Okay, let's see. Bird's nest, crescent moon, bent nail. Bird's nest, which is not with the bird. Crescent moon, bent nail. Hot dogs! I'm still hungry, by the way. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned that a couple times. There's a champagne bottle and a froggy. Oh, there's a tree. Uh, let's see. The flute is right there. Bird's nest and crescent moon. Where's the bird's nest? I remember finding it. And I remember it being annoyed because I couldn't find it initially. Which is annoying because now I don't remember where it is again. Okay, bird's nest, crescent moon. Where's the bent nail? It's on the window. Yes, it is! The exact same place it was last time I couldn't find it. All right, crescent moon and bent nail. There's only like five people in the other room, by the way. If you can hear them, that's how loud each of them are individually. They are super not quiet. Uh, I forgot what I'm looking for. A crescent moon. I seem to think the crescent moon was over here, but I might be making that up. There it is. Ha ha. I found it. All right, we're gonna go. Do we need, is there batteries? Nope, no batteries in here. Okay, Flynn's Pub, a flask, a butterfly, that's a moth, but close enough. Chinese Lantern, Happy Chinese New Year! As I filmed this, it was earlier this week or last week. I don't know what day it is. <laughs> it's a Saturday. I know it's a Saturday because there are people in my living room. Let's see, a sea monster. Where is a sea monster? Is that a sea monster? No. Sea monster is in the tree. <gasps> yes, it is. That's a Nessie sea monster. And a flask. That's not a flask. This is a bar. Probably tons of flasks. Nessie. Or Champ. Champ is the uh, Loch, Ness, Loch Ness monster that lives in Lake Champlain in between Canada and Vermont. Tunnel of Terror! Alright, spider web, yin yang, scroll, which I had trouble finding the first time for some reason. A crowbar, which is one of the best things to have in these games, except this game you can't use items. This is purely a find it game. Those are eyeballs. <laughs> um. Since this is one of the older ones, basically you are literally just finding things. In the newer games, you can actually... Left... Okay, left is on that side. You can, um... Oh, I found the crowbar. In the later games, you can find an item and then use it for solving puzzles. But these ones are so old, that's not a thing yet. I am looking for a scroll, an eyeball, even though there's two right there, and a valve. Oh, there's a scroll. I keep thinking that's an eyeball, but that's an eight ball, which is very close. Oh, yep, it looks like a rivet. Rivet, rivet. Where's the valve? Oh, wait, we need a battery too. Did we not find a battery yet? Or is this one all set? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> all right, let's go back out. All right, I don't know if we found a battery. No, we did not. Oh, no. Look a blimp. Um, hmm. Not that I really want to find a battery and do those things, but we can't beat the game without it. So let's find a whale. There's a whale. Aw, he's cute. Okay. Is there a battery? Yes, there's a battery in here. How did we miss that? It's very obvious. Okay, we also need a domino. But I don't see one. Okay. So now we have a battery. Let's do one of these. All right. Hanger, paper punch, padlock, gavel again. Two playing cards, three skulls. Well, I know where the skulls are. Or at least... No, I know where all three of them are. That one's over here. An iron and a cane. So we need a hanger, which I think is over here. Yes. Paper punch, which I think is over here. 
but I'm wrong. Nope. A gavel, which I've already forgotten if I found last time. I don't know why I have such a problem with that. All right, paper punch, padlock, and gavel. Paper punch, padlock, and gavel. Punch, what is it? Paper punch. What is it? Typewriter? Oh, there's a lock. There's an iron. And a playing card. Hmm. Oh, there's a cane. Oh, there's the gavel. It's tiny. I was looking for a bigger one. Okay, a paper punch and one playing card. Did I see a card up here and not click on it? No. There it is. Okay. Next. All right, now this one is a x-ray vision thing instead of a necklace instead of a in the dark flashlight which is probably even more illegal but i'm not actually positive about that all right we need a pistol three stamps a bell boots cowboy hat pipe wrench and two butterflies there's pipe no oh pipe wrench <laughs> okay pistol three stamps and a bell those are socks not boots here's stamp An apple is a different color necklace and a butterfly. Oh, that's cool. Is a ducky and a hand and a bomb? A planet. What am I looking for? A pistol, two stamps, a bell, and boots. A pistol, two stamps, a bell, and a nose. I remember this level because of the nose. Look, it's Donatello's face mask and a tooth on a doorknob. That's weird. A bell. Let's see. Oh, I needed two butterflies, and I totally went right by both of them. Good job, me. I don't know why I suddenly remembered that. Glasses. The pupper. Okay, pistol, two stamps, boots, a cowboy hat. I thought I saw a cowboy hat, too. And a pipe wrench. Oh, this is very tiring. I'm glad they decided. Wow, that's annoying. I'm glad they decided that these were not a good idea in later games. I mean, it definitely adds interest to the game while you're playing, especially since you can't do anything besides just look for stuff. But oh man, I do not miss these. Pistol, two stamps, and a... Yes. No, no, I agree. I'm just saying. I can understand why they tried to do different things. But... This was not a good idea. Or at least it didn't end up being a good idea. Yeah. Like if the thingy was bigger, maybe? I don't know. I'm not sure how you could fix this to make it more useful. Maybe less things in the room? What am I looking for? A pistol, a stamp, and a pipe wrench. We have to do one more of these after this. Ugh. Pistol. Cowboy. No, the cowboy has a whip. Okay. It's a fishy. Is that a pipe wrench? Yes, that's a pipe wrench. Okay, so we need one stamp. Oh, there's a pistol. Yay! I wasn't looking under the sink. Good. Next. Alright. Last one. Ugh. Okay. Royal seal, button, tea bag, mail symbol, gallows. Spade, fox, pair of dice. Okay, so I need a royal seal, a button, a tea bag. Royal seal, button, and oh, I don't think we played this level before. This stuff doesn't look really familiar. Royal seal, teal bag, teal bag, tea bag, male symbol, and gallows. And another pupper and a strawberry. I can't wait for strawberry season. I don't know why, but it's like I've been thinking about them. But right now, where I am, strawberries for a box of strawberries is like $10. And I do not want strawberries enough to pay $10 for a box of strawberries. That Oh, that's the female symbol. I'm an idiot. A bat. What am I looking for? A royal seal, a male symbol, gallows. Oh, I saw a fox. There it is. Look, this mom is drinking beer with her baby. The past was weird, y'all. Up oh, there's the male symbol. 
Is that the royal seal? Yes, okay. A watermelon. Okay, gallows, a spade, and a pair of dice. I don't remember seeing any dice. Oh, there's a gallows. Somebody was playing hangman. I wonder if kids these days even know what that is, since they don't have to be bored in school anymore. They can just play on their phones. Not that that's a bad thing. It's just weird. Spade and a pair of dice. Like, there's so many stupid things we did in school because we literally didn't have anything else to do. And now they have other things to do. Very weird. Oh, there's a spade. Okay, let's get out of here and go back to some regular levels. There we go. Okay, a valve. There's Gear Clown. And a headstone that says Boo. <laughs> be a silly thing to put on your headstone. How many more do I have? I have four and I have four hints. We are totally using a hint. Up oh, there it is. Okay. Aristoc- oh no, not that one. In the tenement. Here we go. Let's do this one. Domino. I still do not see the domino. Okay. Use a hint. Wow. That's very well hidden. Okay, two more. Oh, for heaven's sakes, I keep clipping on the wrong ones. Okay, here we go. A bent nail. Yeah, I know, I was, I was looking for two sets of dots too. So, yes, that was in fact very mean. Oh, there's the bent nail. Got it. All right, one more. And of course, we only have the dark ones. Let's do the 10 of it. What am I looking for? A stamp. Oh, I was looking for the other kind of stamp. All right. Oh no! 10 sports! And Erdite isn't here! I found football, because it's got two O's. I don't know, maybe we should just look for all the ones that have ball at the end. Tennis on the left. My other left. Tennis. Oh, for heaven's sakes. All right, let's look for all the ball. I'll start over here and you start over there with this ball. Okay, basketball. Um, maybe double L's. There's another one. What is this one? Softball. It's not that. Why does it keep doing that? Bowling on the right. Bowling. I'm better at this than I am. Yep, yep. Uh, let's see. What other things end with ball? There's more L's. Ball. Baseball. Baseball. Skiing is on the right. Yes, it is. Skiing. Stop. Skiing is a weird word. All right, we need three more. I don't know. Did I run out of ball ones? Oh, no. Okay, we have football, baseball, basketball, bowling, tennis, skiing, and softball. Cycling is on the bottom backwards. How did you even find that? What's another... <laughs> Filth? That's not a thing. Um, what's another sport? Football, baseball, basketball, bowling, tennis, skiing, softball... Um... <laughs> Uh, skating. Oh, like ice skating on the left. My other left. Skating. Why didn't that work? Skating. Okay. You worried me there for a minute, game. I'm dyslexic. Have I mentioned I'm dyslexic? Yay! The only reason that worked is because it was lots of words with ball in it. <laughs> Mr. Swanson was at home paying his overdue electric bills when Her Majesty's gem was removed from the gallery. This penniless pro protagonist is quite innocent, I'm afraid. Why is that bad? It's not bad if somebody's innocent. Oh, this person looks lovely. 
Constance Noring. Ha ha ha. The snoozy cruiser. Curiosity shop operator and accidental car thief. Suspect convicted on grand theft auto charges. A longtime narcoleptic, Miss Noring, has a history of waking up in jail after a night of carjacking while sleepwalking? That's not how narcolepsy works. Search the curiosity shop as well as other capital city locations for evidence. When enough clues are found, use the puzzling power of the crime computer to uncover where the suspect was when the dastardly crime took place. Yes, yes it is. Oh, jeez Louise, you'd think I'd remember which ones of these were those. All right, there's a green bunny, because that's a thing. And a paw print. And a puzzle piece, and a fir tree, and a rocket. Is this an actual rocket, or is this a bomb that they keep thinking is a rocket? A spear. I just saw the spear. There it is. A seashell and two notes. There's one note. It says, don't give up. Rocket by the base. Yeah, that's not a rocket. That's a bomb. Just in case anybody needs to know that. Not a rocket. All right, puzzle piece, fir tree, seashell, and note. Is that a note? I mean, that's technically a type of note, but I guess that's not what they meant. All right, puzzle piece, fir tree, seashell, note. Puzzle piece, oh, there's the fir tree, and there's seashell. All right, so a note and a puzzle piece. Up oh, there's puzzle piece. Where's the note? A note. No, those are notes. Okay, next place. There's no battery here, right? Nope. All right, Curiosity Shop. We've been here before. This is a very silly store. All right, or origami. I thought this said original crane. No origami crane, as opposed to the two. Oh, there's one. Big cranes that are flying through here. A maple leaf. A scallop shell. A balloon. Balloon. Battery bottom middle. Yes, it is. Thank you. A pipe, a bell. Oh, there's a shell. And two flowers and a shoehorn. Balloon, pipe, bell, flowers, and shoehorn. Balloon, pipe, bell. There's a flower. And some grapes. And then another flower. Uh, let's see. Balloon, pipe, bell, shoehorn. Balloon. That's creepy. Bipe. Pipe, not bipe. A bipe is not a thing, as far as I know. There's a balloon. Okay. <laughs> pipe, bell, shoehorn. Pop, 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 pipe. Pipe, pipe. Ooh, there's a pipe. That's Norman Rockwell, isn't it? I think it's Norman Rockwell. A bell and a shoehorn. That's not a bell. Oh, there's a shoehorn. All right, next. Uh, community club. Tag nab it. Fine, we're here. Let's go. Treble clef police lights. Sheriff's badge. Jack clothespin. Puzzle piece. Rat gallows. Okay. Treble clef police light. Jack. Treble clef police lights. Jack. Clothespin. There's a jackrabbit. Does that count? Nope. Oh wait, there's a jack. Treble clef, police light, puzzle piece, rat. I saw the rat too. Didn't I? No, I did see him here though. There, there he is. Okay. Oh, and the gallows is over here. Okay, so treble clef, police light, puzzle piece. Treble clef, police light, puzzle piece. Treble clef, police light, police light. Oh, like for on top of a police car. Except I think that's supposed to be an ambulance. Like, old-fashioned one. Ambulances were just like station wagons back in the day. They put you in the back and drove you to the hospital and hopefully you made it. <laughs> I would love to see this act, by the way. The dude and then the dude with a monkey head and a tutu. I bet it's very interesting. What am I looking for? A treble clef and a puzzle piece. Oh my gosh. A treble clef and a puzzle piece. Puzzle piece is on the envelope. Here? Oh, you're right. 
good job! Alright, and we'll go to the carousel. Grapes. Apple. You did help! Beetle. Uh, violin. Ladle. Ladle, ladle, ladle. Bar stool. A whisk broom. I don't think that's what that is. I think that's a straw broom. That's okay. Cowbell. Okay, a beetle and a ladle. Beetle, 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 beetle. Is that a beetle? I mean, it is a beetle, but it's also a ladybug, so that doesn't count. And a centipede. I dislike centipedes. They are creepy and move too fast. What am I looking for? A beetle and a ladle. Is that a ladle? Yes, it is. Oh, and there's a beetle! Yay! Okay. City Park. Saxophone. Over here, a toy train. Oh, there's the boa. A lantern. A sweet roll. Oh, I could go for a, go for a cinnamon roll right now. One of my friends, they have been making cinnamon rolls and all kinds of different variations on that theme and they keep posting pictures and I kind of want to kill them. <laughs> it's like, no, stop showing me pictures of cinnamon rolls. Ah, I want them so bad. Cinnamon rolls are one of my weaknesses because one of my favorite things in life is frosting. Like in all its many forms. And one of the things that cinnamon rolls have is frosting. Where is the toy train? Oh, there he is. He was in the garbage. It so is. All right, let's keep going. The conservatory. This is a very weird conservatory, but I do love this giant butterfly. All right, let's see. A star. That's a star. A Roman soldier. Very weird thing to have in here. That's not a Roman soldier. That's a Roman soldier. A woman's portrait. I think that's you. A seahorse. Egg seahorses too. They're so cute. Sea dragons are even cooler than seahorses, but seahorses are adorable. Let's see. Uh, poison, which probably shouldn't be in a greenhouse. A banana. -na. A clock. That's a watch. And a fan. All right, let's see. So we need a star, a clock, and a fan. There's an elephant, and a frog, and a heart. Pay attention. There's the clock. Star, clock, fan. So we need a star and a fan. Is that a fan? No. We need a spider. Fan in the statue hand. Yes, it is. Oh, and there's a star right in the middle of the screen. Why do I have such a hard time finding stuff right in the middle of the screen? That doesn't make a lot of sense. Ah, we're back at the gallery! Alright, let's see. Tongs. A club. What kind of club? A grappling hook. Oop. An inchworm. Inchworms are adorable! Jeremy is. Actually, I think that's a regular caterpillar. But inchworms are adorable. Uh, let's see. What am I looking for? Club ribbon. A vinyl record which I totally saw. There it is. A spoon. Yep. And a heart, which I also totally saw. Oh, there's a club. Where's the heart? There it is. And a ribbon. Uh, okay, focus. I know that's difficult for you and everything, but... You would think with less things in the room, stuff would be easier to find. I guess I'm not looking for the right shape of ribbon. All right, next. Yeah, I, I agree. I think we have also. Ugh, fine. Not a rocket. That's a bomb. All right, a skull, an eagle, a fish, three X's, a lamp, two dogs, and a spider. So a skull, an evil, an evil. My brain is just not here. A skull, an eagle, a fish, and three X's. A skull, an eagle, a fish. Three X's. A skull, an eagle, three X's, a lamp, and two dogs. Did I see a dog yet? No. Skull. There's a puppy. That's a dog. Thank you. I was gonna get mad about that one. 
Definitely a dog. Skull, eagle, three X's. Oh, there's one X. And a lamp. Okay. Skull, eagle, two X's, and a dog. Skull and eagle. Is that a skull? No. Skull and eagle, two X's, and a dog. Skull, is that a dog? No, it's a mouse. Skull! Eagle! So two X's and a dog. There's an X. I need a bird. Is that a dog? Yes! Alright, I'm going to do this one. Where's the gavel? I'm getting the gavel first. <laughs> There's a wrench. Alright, two frogs. A baseball, which is over here. An axe, which is over here. A horse, a shovel, and a ruler. That was over here. Maybe not. Okay. Two frogs, horse, shovel, ruler. Two frogs. Is that a horse? I can't figure out what that is. Two frogs, horse, shovel, a frog. Shovel, ruler. Frog, horse, shovel, ruler. Is that a frog? No. Frog, shovel, ruler. Frog, frog. That's not a ruler. That's a tape measure. There's a frog. Shovel and a ruler. I know I've seen the ruler in here before. Are we allowed to be like breaking into people's houses and finding information? Isn't that illegal? Like, I'm pretty sure it's illegal. I mean, breaking into people's house is illegal if you're not stealing anything at all. Just breaking into the house is illegal. That's why it's breaking and entering. Because both of the things are bad. Is that a ruler? No, that's the cane. Rawr. Alright, I'm gonna use a hint here. What am I looking at? Oh, that's a shovel! Wow, I never would have found that. Okay, next. Alright, we need five more. Let's try the ones that aren't in the dark. Ribbon. Not a ribbon. Oh my gosh, they're getting louder. That's a handle. Is that- oh, that's a ribbon. I remember that. Because it didn't look like a ribbon. The curator's office, that's a city park. Alright, so we need a sword. Where's the sword? Sword, 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 sword. Sword. That's a knife, not a sword. You need a sword too? I mean, you could get a sword and like- oh, there it is. And like hang one on your wall somewhere. That would look pretty cool, you know. Curiosity shop. A bell. Is that a bell? There we go. Alright. Two more. One note. You'd think this would be easy. There's a nose. And a spade. And this is not a note, even though it's kind of a note. It's on the yellow speaker. Oh, you're right! Yep. One more. What should we look at? Uh, I want to know where the ruler is. Oh, I completely missed that. Another puzzle! She's very weird outfit on. Not bad, just unusual. Okay, let's see. What else is in this picture? Oh, this is the curiosity shop. <sighs> Some weird stuff in this place. There. Where's your you go there. Yay! Exceptionally done, Agent Fate. Constance Noring was meandering her place of business in a deep slumber the night the diamond was stolen. 
This pajama wearing sleepy creep was nowhere near the scene of the crime and thus no prime suspect. Oh, she's wearing pajama pants. That makes more sense. Click below to begin analyzing another subject. Okay. So if I am correct, this is the last prime suspect. Anybody home. Oh, that's terrible. AKA mommy. Occupation, housewife and suspected master thief. Prior arrest, none. Mother's day, mother by day and nefarious interloper by night. Many diligent crime inspectors have tried to gather enough clues to arraign this shady lady, but so far she remains free, a free bird. Can you prove she's the one and only capital city shadow? Find a battery to power your scan array device and then take a peek inside the bank vault for clues. You'll have to search other locations as well if you want to figure out where the suspect was when the Queen's Hope was taken from the museum. If she is that suspicious, isn't it likely that she's probably the person who stole the thingy? Alright, so this isn't- oh, right, we need a battery. And that one needs a battery. This one doesn't. Okay. Yes, it does, doesn't it? All right, let's see. A hawk, a seashell, champagne. That's a beer bottle. Champagne. Two triangles, there's one over here. A pipe wrench, which is, a, that's still not a pipe wrench. Uh, let's see, sweets. I want sweets. That's a sweet thing. I guess they probably mean like candy. Oh, there we go. Almost Valentine's Day, relatively speaking. Wait, is it next Friday? Yeah, I think it's next Friday. If you are watching this now, Valentine's Day is next Friday, which means next Saturday is time to buy all your cheap chocolate. I've lost my train of thought. Okay, Hawk, Triangle, Crescent Moon, and Two Crowns. Not as much as they used to. You can still find some. But yeah, grocery stores and whatnot tend to be very stingy about the stuff they put on sale these days. It's very sad. You used to be able to just stock up on like a week's worth of candy after every candy holiday. Now, not so much. Hawk, Triangle, Crescent, Moon. Oh, there's a crown. Oh, Ott, I think your brother is now here too. Oh, there's the hawk. Really? Good job, brain. One triangle and crescent moon. Yeah, I, I'm not opening the door to say hi. I don't want to get involved with all that nonsense until I absolutely have to. They are loud and it is quiet in here. <laughs> what am I looking for? All right, I need to keep going. My brain is starting to like very much dilapidate here. Tarantula. And what else? A pipe. Did you know that in Animal Crossing that they have dung beetles and they push around snowballs in the winter? Isn't that silly? That's just silly business. A giraffe. There's a giraffe. A lion's head. Isn't it cute? It's like adorable. Oh, there's a lion's head. A hammer and a pear. I think that pear would be over here. Hammer, pear, a fire alarm, and a satchel. Okay, tarantula, pipe, and a hammer. There's a hammer. That is definitely a hammer. Not the kind of hammer you want. Oh, there's a tarantula. And I saw the pipe. There's a pipe. Where's the hammer? We don't see the hammer. Was that him? Yep, got him. The little buggers are really hard to catch too because it's hard to notice they're there until like you're right on top of them and then they just run away. A bass, as opposed to a bass, which is spelled exactly the same. A spider, two turtles, there's a lizard. Do I need a lizard? No. A chalkboard. That's really weird. Oh, there it is. George, who's over here. A shark. And a pen and a spear. Okay, two turtles, a shark, and a pen. There's a shark. And there's a pen. We need two turtles. And a key cat. And a shell and a puppy. Oh, there's a turtle. And I need one more turtle. Where is the turtle? 
Oh, wow, there he is. Look at this. It's the top of the ticket counter. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> All right, and we go back to Madame Ball Reader. Madame Palm Ball Reader or something like that? Or Madame Ball, Ball Palm Reader? He's a big turtle. Where's the cantaloupe? I know he's in here. There he is. Two candy sticks. Which one is right here? Yeah, I, I when we leave, remind me to look and see what the actual name of the place is because it, it's silly business. Uh, let's see. A lightning bolt, which I remember having a hard time finding. A garlic clove. I'm still hungry. <laughs> a wishbone. It's on the poster. The lightning bolt. There it is. A pear. Nope, that's an avocado. There's a pear. Four crescent moons. There's one. Two. Let's see what else? A Ouija board made by Milton Bradley. Yep. So one candy. Which I thought they both were on here, but maybe not. One. Oh, there it is. A garlic, a wishbone, and two crescent moons. Okay, a garlic, a wishbone. Up oh, there's the garlic. A wishbone and two crescent moons. Up oh, there's one. I'm not home. What? Your glasses? Hang on. Glasses are in here. Yes, your glasses are in here. <sighs> Close the door. I'm sorry, he says as he closed the door. Tell Amber I'm not in the mood. <laughs> Cold. <laughs> Madam Ball Palm Reader. That is, in fact, the name of the place. Okay. All right, what am I doing? Paperclip. And a pear. And a telephone. And a spoon and a lizard. Where's the lizard? I saw him. There's a lizard. And... A key is above the flippers. Where are the flippers? <laughs> Wait. Oh, there's a key. And the flippers. Gotcha. An arrow. Oh, the arrow is up here too, isn't it? Yep. Arrow. And I thought the wallet was down here somewhere. Maybe I'm making that up. Telephone, spoon, and a wallet. Okay. There's a telephone. Spoon. And a wallet. Up oh, there it is. I was right, it was down here. Where's this spoon? Alright. Alright, let's do these stupid ones. Wait, did we find a battery yet? No, we didn't. Dag nab it. No, well, it's not here. Is there a battery here? That's not a battery. Up oh, there it is. Alright, let's start over here. Baboon, snake. Pine cone, nunchucks, handcuff, pork chop, roses, baby bottle. That is a very weird assortment of things. A baboon, a snake, and a pine cone. Baboon, a snake, and a pine cone. And a snake. Alright, so a baboon, a pine cone, and nunchucks. Baboon, baboon, pine cone, nunchucks. That's not nunchucks. That's nunchucks. A baboon, a pine cone, handcuffs. Handcuffs? Good. Baboon, pine cone, pork chops, and roses. Why would you- That's actually, uh, those are lamb chops, not pork chops. Donuts! Those aren't donuts, those are eggies. What am I looking for? Pine cone. Baboon, roses, baby bottle. Baboon... There's a raccoon. They rhyme. Baboon, roses, baby- Oh, there's a baby bottle. There's a baboon? Actually, I can't tell what that is. Nope, okay. That's a cool dragon. Right. Caterpillar. There's a weird assortment of stuff in this bank. I mean, there's some normal things, but some of it's just strange. There's the roses. Alright, 
Next. All right, pliers, three stamps, maple leaf, lightning bolt, tree, pen, lips, two rockets. Okay, so pliers, three stamps, maple leaf, lightning bolt. Pliers, three stamps, maple leaf, three stamp. Labels, pliers, three stamps, maple leaf. Stop it! There we go. Maple leaf. Pliers, stamps, lightning bolt, tree. There's lightning bolt. Pliers, stamps, tree, pen. Pliers, stamps, tree, pen. Pliers, there's a tree. Pliers, stamps, pen, lips. Pliers, there's pen. And two rockets. Pliers, stamps, lips, rocket. Pliers, stamps. There's nose. Lips. Rocket! Yay! Pliers, stamp, lips, rocket. Pliers, stamps. I don't know what they're doing out there, but I probably don't want to know. Lips, rockets. Okay. This is not good. Pliers, stamps, lips, rocket. You have lips. No, okay. Lips, rock. Up oh, there. Once again, not a rocket. Pliers, stamp, lips. Pliers. Wait, aren't the pliers under here? Oh, oh no, that's a wrench. Sorry. Hey, you pupper. Pliers. Stamp. Oh, there's lips. Okay, we're gonna go someplace with that. Let's see. Alright, do this one. <sighs> Alright. Padlock, which was over here. Dartboard, which we think would be easy to find. Two frogs. One of the frogs is there. And it's over here. Magnifying glass. Right here. Oh, there's the dartboard. Uh, roller skates. And two pairs of glasses. One. Two. Okay. Th actually, the thread is here, so we just need a gear. Let's see if we can find the gear. There it is. Yay! The trick to these is just memorizing where everything is. That's all. Alright, let's go back over here. A wishbone and a crescent moon. Oh, there's the wishbone. Where's the moon? Oh. I should have seen that. Okay, and the playhouse is a triangle and a crescent moon. What's with all the moons? Alright. Triangle. There's a moon. There's a triangle. Moons are cool. Moons are cool. Well, I mean, we only have one moon, but I guess moons in general are cool. I don't feel like for that one. Rocco's news is spoon. I am 100% positive I found the spoons before. Yes. Well, you are specifically into moons because you write sci-fi. Newspaper. Ah, yes. Thank you. As a sci-fi author... Oh, as a sci-fi author, uh, you definitely enjoy moons more than the next person would. Oh, it's right there. Jeez Louise. And planets, yes. Okay, what was this one? A baboon. Oh, wow. That's not a baboon, that's a monkey. Sheesh. Ugh. All right, here we go again. This game is purposely annoying. At least to me. I love it when I'm off by one square. That's fun. mostly me just not liking the fact that there's pictures that are pretty much exactly- I don't know why I keep picking on that one. 
Oh, now I'm not gonna pick it. You stupid brain. Pirates. Oh no. Miss Buddy Home was suspected of burglarizing the Captain Capital City Savings and Loan when the diamond was taken from the gallery. Wait, what? This surveillance photo proves her innocence in the vault robbery, but also promotes her to the rank of prime suspect in the matter at hand. Huh? How does that make sense? Wait, if she didn't steal the gem, then why is she a prime suspect for stealing the gem? All right, the guilty party, AKA unknown, occupation unknown, prior arrest. Mysterious individual wanted on charges of grand larceny for robbing the Piazza Gallery. Sus suspect insidiously removed the Queen's Hope Diamond from its display case after the museum had closed. The FBI's reputation is tarnished while suspect remains at large. You've narrowed the hunt down to five prime suspects, but now you must venture forth and find clues to figure out which suspect is responsible for stealing the Queen's Hope. Oh boy, I hope this doesn't take 45 minutes. Okay, let's see. Let's, let's get through this. Biohazard, stick of candy, bottle and a ladybug. That's not a ladybug. It's a ladybug. That was paradise. Where did I just see them? There they are. A harmonica, which I also remember seeing. A paper clip and a scroll. Scroll right there. Okay. Candy, bottle, harmonica, paper clip. Candy, bottle, harmonica, paper clip. Right, where's the candy? Oh, and there's the candy. Good. Okay, not doing that one. This one, yeah, this is a list. All right, let's see. Two combs. This one. Record. Cane. Oyster. Cat. Cat. It's hiding. Two citrus fruits. There's orange. And a grapefruit. Three fans. Home. Thank you. Uh, let's see. A spider. Okay, that's octopus, not a spider. I knew what you meant. All right, so we need a record, a cane, one fan, and a spider. A record, a cane. I know what you meant. <laughs> a record. All right, a fan and a spider. Fan. There's spider. Where's the fan? There's fan. Okay, and then that one's there. Okay, theater. Air filter. Okay. Oh, that's that. Car air filter. A hook. A strand of pearls. A pair of dice. Orange slices. George. Film reel. A spoon. Oh, a hook and a spoon. That looked weird for a minute. I don't know why. Alright, so there's the hook. Where's the spoon? Is that a spoon? Yes. Oh wait, we were just there. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Two lions. There's one. A uh, banana. Here. Four hex signs. I think it's cheating that you make they make you find four of things and that counts as one item. That's not fair. Okay. A ruler. Two spoons. Lots of spoons in this game. A mask. Two feathers and a shepherd's staff. Okay. A lion, spoons, and feathers. Feathers. 
Alright, so we need a lion and two spoons. I don't think I was looking for spoons. I think I was just like glancing at stuff. Alright, where's the lion? Is that a lion? Yep, okay. So two spoons. Did I mention I'm still hungry? <laughs> <laughs> wow, I don't see any spoons. Do you see any spoons? Oh, there's one. I found one. I found one. I should have eaten. I will do that next time. All right, I found one spoon. Where's the other spoon? All right, we'll come back and find the other spoon. All right, let's see. A woman's eye. A rolling pin. A frog. Where's a frog? I remember him. Soda bottle. Two rats. There's one. And there's the other one. Rolling pin is up. Yep, okay. A golf ball inside the tuba. A wire brush, which I seem to remember having trouble finding last time. Or last time we... Is that it? No, it's a comb. And a necklace. There's the necklace. Okay. Frog soda bottle. Wire brush is on the wheel. Oh, yes! I remember because I was looking for the other kind of brush. All right, frog and a soda bottle. Froggy, where are you? I'm looking to find you. Soda bottle is in the flowers. You are a liar. Oh, no, there it is. <laughs> Froggy, there he is. I remembered him being here. All right, community. Oh, freaking. Is there a battery here? Curious office. We didn't find a battery. Dang damn it. Where's this dumb battery? It's not in this one. Nope, not in this one. There it is. Stupid battery. Alright, let's do the bank first. Alright, knife, fan, mailbox, comb, worm, pork chops. Those aren't pork chops. A la mode and two fishing lures. Okay. Knife, fan, mailbox, comb. Next year, fan. Mailbox, fan. Alright. Knife, mailbox, comb, worm. It is snake. Snakes are like worms. Uh, knife, fan, fan, mailbox. A la mode. Comb. Knife, mailbox, comb, worm. Knife, mailbox, comb, worm. Ugh. Nope. Knife. Mailbox. Comb. Where is it? That's not a worm. That's a caterpillar. All right. Knife. Mailbox. Comb. Two fishing lures, which I was not looking for at all. Knife. Mailbox. Mailbox. Knife. Comb. Fishing lures. Okay. Knife. Comb. All right. So two fishing lures and a knife. 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 Up. Oh, there's fishing lure. And where's the knife? Knife. That's a bacon. My hubby made bacon and salmon at the same time earlier because he was doing meal prep and it was a very confusing set of smells. It wasn't bad. It was just like, what is it that you're cooking that smells like that? No, they were, ah, there's the knife. They, they were for two different uh, recipes, I assume. Maybe they weren't. All right, cat spider is over here. Green worm, coin, four nines, four nines, two hearts, two butterflies, and a small bird. There's a butterfly. Cat worm, coin, and nines. Cat worm, coin, there's a nine. Aw. There's another nine. There's a dog. Cat worm, coin, and nines. Cat worm, coin, coin. There's a nine. Okay. Catworm, coin, and nines. There's heart. It's still not a coin. Cat, mouse, lizard, bug. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. There's another heart. Okay. Catworm. I didn't find any of that stuff. Catworm, coin, and nine. Okay, good. Catworm, coin, and butterfly. Catworm, coin, and butterfly. Catworm. Coin and butterfly. There's a coin. Is that a worm? Oh, okay. I thought that was a ribbon. 
Cat, butterfly, small bird. Cat, butterfly. That's a moth. Alright, so we need a cat and a small bird. There's a small bird. There's a small bird. Okay, good. Ugh, these levels drive me crazy. Alright, let's see. Rat, bow tie, yin yang, pipe, accordion, puzzle piece. Puzzle piece. Beer and a watermelon. Watermelon. Rat, bow tie. Oh, is the rat here? Yes, rat. Bow tie, yin yang, pipe, accordion, beer. Oh, beer, not bear. Bowtie, yin yang, pipe. Pipe. Bowtie, yin yang, accordion, beer. Bowtie, yin yang, accordion, beer. That's a concertina, not an accordion. Oh, let's see. There, there's the beer. I forgot. That was totally in one of the other ones. Aw, oh, it's not original to the poster. A bowtie and a yin yang. A bowtie. There we go. And a yin yang. Up oh, there it is. Yes. All right, what do we got left? I know, isn't it relaxing? I know I'm relaxed. Banana, two apples, eye, scallop shell, mouse, lightning bolt, which is right there, and two rockets. I forgot what I was looking for already. Banana, two apples, eye, and a shell. Banana, apples, eye, shell. Banana, apple, I oh, got two apples. Banana, eye, shell, mouse. I saw the mouse. Where is him? There he is. Banana, eye, shell, rockets. Was it one of them over here? Yes, it was. Where is it? There it is. And then the other one's over here. Okay. Banana, eye, shell, bell. Banana, eye, shell, bell. Banana, eye, shell, bell. Banana, eye, shell. banana. I shell bell. Hi. So we just need a shell and a bell. Shell bell. Shell bell. There's a bell. There's a shell. Oh, I'm gonna be so happy not to do any more of these. Two bells, two glasses. Oh, the glasses are. Pepper grinder, hanger, a wrench, two spoons, two shells, one and two, and a lobster. All right, is that a bell? No, that's an ornament. Okay, so two bells, pepper grinder, wrench, and two spoons. Bell, pepper grinder, wrench, spoon. Bell, pepper grinder, wrench. Where's the bell? Yay! Okay. Bell, pepper grinder, spoon. Oh my gosh, they're so freaking loud. Ugh. And I have noise canceling headphones on, so I can't even hear them all the way. You guys can probably hear. That's a coffee grinder, not a pepper grinder. You pro guys can probably hear them better than I can. And they're still loud. There's a pepper grinder. Okay, a bell and two spoons. A bell. There's one spoon. Is that another spoon here? Nope, okay. It is a spoon, but that's okay. A bell. There's a bell. And one more spoon. I can't imagine they're playing Arkham with the kids because the kids wouldn't want to sit for that long. I have no idea what they're playing out there, but they are sure loud about it. We need one more. Let's do this one. And use a hint. Yay, a spoon. All right, now what do we do? Okay, I guess this is it. So who is it? I don't remember what the suspects were. We should have looked back over the suspects before we uh, went to the last thing. I didn't think of that. It's this person. I forget who this person is. Wow, they didn't dress very inconspicuously to go rob someplace, did they? Are they wearing a scarf? It's the guy I don't- I, I know, I, we, we haven't seen all of the dudes for a long time, so we totally should have uh, looked to see which ones was which. That is a massive diamond! Oh my gosh! That's crazy! 
All right, what do we got going here? Here appears here. Okay. Um, this is the up part. The up part. That's a good name for that. The crown molding, maybe? Or the ceiling? Forgive me, I'm tired. Part goes up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm good at words. I don't know if you guys knew that. I pride myself in my language skills. Busted! Absolutely brilliant work, Master Detective. Fate. That's me. <laughs> You've proven that John Thomas stole the Queen's hope from the Piazza Gallery. I have no idea who that person was. The authorities have just informed said suspect has been detained, but the diamond appears to be missing! Oh no! Oh. Wait, I gotta see what this dude was. Which one was this guy? This guy. Oh, he's the soccer hooligan. <laughs> Wait, where did it go? Oh no! Wait, where's the thing I'm supposed to do? <laughs> Hang on, let me try leaving and coming back. <laughs> I totally clicked off of it. <clears throat> there we go. All right, except we're at two hours. Do you think we can get through this in half an hour or 25 minutes? What do you think? Because I'm hungry and this is long. <laughs> All right, let's do it then. Level 22, villainous thief. AKA John Thomas, occupation license plate manufacturer, prior arrests. Guilty party has been apprehended on charges of grand larceny in defrauding the Piazza Gallery of the Queen's Hope. The diamond, however, remains missing and could be anywhere in Capital City. Said gem is thought to be hidden inside a box like the one shown here on your case report. The convicted felon gave no clues to its whereabouts, but when asked about unlocking the box, they said, A hit from me declares danger to thee. Okay. Find the jewel box! Let's go! We've been playing this game for six hours. That's crazy. Oh, there's not as many places to look for things. Wait a minute. There's, we only need one thing? Oh, we just, why do we need 45 minutes to find the box? We just need to find the box. Oh, okay. Uh, that's easy, she says optimistically. Editing me is now gonna put in how long it actually takes us to find the box. <laughs> okay. I don't see it. And it's not like it can be behind anything or in things in this game either. Ugh, gosh darn it. Heaven forbid we get away with not doing that. Which means it's probably in the place where we need the flashlight. Oh no, there it is. I found it. Okay, now what? Place a gem on the box by clicking a circle. Next, click an adjacent circle to slide the gem into. All seven gems must be placed in the box for it to open. Wait, what? Oh. This is weird, isn't it? Oh! Oh, okay. So I can't move them once they're on there. That's annoying. All right. Nope, that's not going to work either. I have to go back and forth across. Okay. This better not be why it says it's going to take me 45 minutes. Oh, wait, I think I know. Oh, I can't reset it unless I get run out. Fine, be that way. Dang it, I almost had it mentally. Okay. No, no, I can't do this one. Oh, it's selling. Well, no, I can put one there and one there. <sighs> Not even gonna let me skip it. 
Oh, I have to use logic. Okay, so it has to slide once. So the only one that can't doesn't have to slide is the last one. No, no. I got it. No, I'm one short. Dang, damn it. That was close. Ugh, my brain does not like this at all. Okay, so I need two next to each other at least. The last ones have to be across from each other. Like that, but they have to be across from each other. I just did it wrong. These two have to stay empty now. <laughs> no, because they have to be across from each other, not across from each other. So this one and this one, shush! This one and this one have to be empty. So where does the third one to the last one have to be? Wow. I hate this. I don't know. I don't know at all. Nope. Yeah, All right. Thank you. Last. Oh, you know what? I need a piece of paper. This is a, this is a riveting stream, isn't it? Why is that so hard for my brain? There are eight thingies. Oh, no, 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 it's not hard. Okay. I got it. That's what my mind is trying to do. I cannot do it without seeing it on paper. My dyslexia was not having it. Dear Master Detective, congratulations. I'm delighted to hear that you have successfully solved the case and returned the missing diamond. On behalf of the Bureau, I would like to extend our gratitude by bestowing upon you the agent, the title of Honorary Federal Agent. In addition, we have received word from London that Her Majesty the Queen is quite impressed with your skills and requests your assistance in Europe with a most mysterious and puzzling matter. Yours truly, Sue Pervisor. They had to get one last one of those in. All right. Yay. Next is Ravenhurst. Trey. Oh my gosh. Wow. Six hours and 15 minutes. That is crazy. Oh wait, what was that? Credits. Wow, that's it. 2006. That's crazy. All right. Well, I, for one, am glad we are done with that game. It was fun, but oh my gosh, my eyeballs are dying. <laughs> I really hope the next game has a smaller screen size, or a bigger screen size, rather. Not smaller. Oh, well, heck no, heck no. Okay, so that was tiring. <laughs> And it was also lots of fun. That was the number two game. Now we start in the Ravenhurst series. And the Ravenhurst series goes on for a long time. I'm not sure if it stays like we're in that forever. But it's definitely a, uh, a running theme. Yes, I'm going to go eat. Hang on a second. I'm just closing up.
So next we will do the next mystery case files we do will be Ravenhurst. And the next uh, Let's Play we do will be Mystery Trackers again. And I am going to go eat dinner because I'm starving and we've been playing for two and a half hours and I did not expect that. So, I am Fate Touched and I will see you later. Bye!